Hello everyone. I am Stephanie. I am the woman behind the cats and the camera. Well, it's phone today because my camera's broken. Um, I wanted to introduce myself for a couple of reasons. One is because with the work with my organization that is fixing to take place, I am in a couple of the videos and I thought it would be better if I introduced myself now um, than just seeing me in the videos. Also, I um, want to do a couple videos in the future that's a little bit difficult when you're just staring at a cat and um, thought it would be better to do it this way. It is a little bit odd being in front of the camera, I will say. Two things. I'm going to try not to ramble. I have a list, but we know I like to ramble. So, we'll see. I can edit a little bit, but then it'll be choppy, and I hate it when they're choppy. First thing, I want to say thank you very, very much. Um, the channel just hit 500 subscribers, and even though I don't really like to um, focus on the numbers, it is a great thing because it shows that people want to watch the videos and they're interested in the cats and the kittens and that's really what it's about is just raising the awareness so I want to thank you very much the second thing is um, and I'll I may put in a reminder at the end that if you have any questions or want any further information uh, um, about what we're gonna discuss then just leave it in the comments. I don't know if I get enough questions or, or something like that. I may do a Q&A, just like a thank you Q&A for the subscribers. I don't know because I don't know how I feel about them, but we'll see. If you have any questions or comments, just leave them below. The first thing, I do want to talk about the kittens. I did try to film this in there with the kittens but it's not it was very difficult and so we're gonna do it this way um I have found them new homes it was very very difficult they will be leaving in a couple days to go to the new homes Baron and Grace are going together and Fig is going to a different home they're both wonderful Baron and Grace his mom has worked with feral and rescue cats before. She has a, um, it, it, Siamese cat, it, it may be mixed Siamese, but beautiful cat named Caddy, who um, also had a, uh, she had a, another cat um, that passed and um, was a rescue cat and feels that she and Caddy need um, to expand their family and wonderful wonderful it's a I'm excited I mean I'm sad but I'm excited and I will say that they will send updates we'll have pictures and videos and I will put them up as I get them fig is going to a home that has a little girl and a little boy um, but the little girl Olivia is about 10 and Fig lets her carry him everywhere. It is so funny. Um, I don't have footage of it because I don't really want to put a child on YouTube. Um, but if the parents send updates and, and give permission, then we may see that. But Fig and Olivia are adorable together. Um, they do not have another cat. They do, however, have a miniature poodle that is about the same size as Chica. So I'm going to assume that they will be best friends because Fig likes dogs way more than cats. And like I said, they will be leaving in a couple days. Once they leave, I will probably take a little bit of time off. Um, it's going to be difficult for you guys but it's also going to be very difficult for me. I've had them for a long time. And I'm going to Atlanta to see my daughter and Lagatha. So there may be some videos of Lagatha or Atlanta or, you know, uh, I do have a lot of kitten footage 
uh, that I haven't played and, and I may do some videos from that. I'm not quite sure. I just know that I will probably need a couple days to get my head back on straight. Now for the new organization. I have started Community Cats of Central Arkansas, which a lot of you are aware, but I am now officially licensed, bonded, insured, and registered. I have uh, three different shelters and rescue organizations that I will be a part of. Um, we are looking at different ways to do things. Anytime you start something, there's going to be trial and error. There will be new kittens. Um, there is a group right now that are three weeks old and they are being bottle reared. Um, the mother had an accident and cannot take care of the kittens. Plus she was feral and it was a very difficult situation. Now the kittens, like I said, are being fostered right now and bottle fed and there are four, but um, I will not get them until at least four weeks and we don't know that they will all survive which is very sad but it is the reality um, if not those kittens there are several other sets because I am going to try to fo focus on uh, feral cats and kittens um, in the videos that you'll see will be socialization of feral cats and kittens mainly kittens um, pretty much what we've been doing only a little bit better I know the last several videos have not been as informative and the same as the beginning but that's I have been very very busy as you see I'm exhausted <laughs> I have been very busy finding them homes getting all the, the business um, put together and uh, getting all the proper registrations and licenses and, and that kind of stuff in order to do rescue legally. <laughs> um, now, I am also with this organization that I've started, I have two foster volunteers. I have um, two or three drivers, transporters, that kind of thing. I have um, one fundraiser uh, individual that will help me with the fundraising locally and I'm still looking for a computer person because we all know my website is not that great I'm not the best at computers I just learned to edit when I started doing this but it will come in time um, I will leave a link below I don't like to ask for donations but this is for the cats and the kittens and the organization so there is going to be a link below to donate or um, you can use my PO box address if you would like to send uh, anything there and also I've updated my Amazon wish list to include supplies um, I would like to have some stocked up for um, the new kittens and for um, anything I might need in the future like I said it's touch and go right now we're not sure exactly how it's gonna go I also have had an estimate on building a 14 by 10 room that will be called the kitten den uh, hopefully that will actually break ground the second week of March um, I don't have all the funding for it yet so if you'd like to donate please do so um, but I'm working on it and I I'm pretty sure it's going to be doable because using my spare room um, for this is not the best and so I think having the den would be a lot better plus it you know gives them not only a quarantine room but a room set up just for cats um, and so the wish list um, has been updated for some of those needs and um, the food. Now, some people might say, well, you know, are the shelters not helping? Now, the shelters have, we have agreed that they will pay for normal vet care. Um, anything above and beyond what they consider normal vet care, I will be responsible for. I will be responsible for their food, their toys, their supplies. 
um, any of the things that go with my business, such as, you know, the computer, the uh, going to visit the homes, the upkeep, that kind of thing. Really, the only thing they're going to take care of is normal vet care at this time. We're working on it. We'll see how it goes. Plus, we've got a couple fundraisers, which are part of the videos that later on you might see that I might be in. Hence, we're doing this. That is pretty much the basis of all I wanted to cover. Um, so, to recap, the kittens are going to a new home pretty soon. We will have new kittens not very long after that. But, like I said, I'm going to take some time off to go to Atlanta. My new company is official. Well, it's an organization, but I call it a company. Um is official it is up and running oh and I did apply for nonprofit status however it takes a while for that to go through once it does I'll update everyone but right now it's just considered a business slash organization um, but like I said I'll update everyone thank you for the 500 subscribers and if you have any questions or comments or want more info uh, please leave that below I was gonna try to update my website to where you could go and look at everything but I'm not sure if it's gonna have been done by the time this video goes up because I just cannot do websites um, and then right after this I'm gonna roll some footage I found some footage uh, when you know my camera broke and I went to try to get it fixed and they found some footage that had saved to the camera instead of the um, SD cards so I'm gonna add some of that to this so you don't have to just listen to me ramble and see me without kittens because I know we're all here for the kittens so thank you very much it was nice seeing everybody and I will talk to you later bye